Hello and welcome back. Double O Debbie and this is episode 42 of my Dire Wolf 21.18 Let's Play. And today we're going to do some more work on <laughs> our brain. Um, no, really. On the on our Dire Wolf building, I put the little uh, porch finished up. Some little finishing touches on it. Got our, uh, it does have our building blocks in here, but that's just temporary. It's going to be, you know, pretty much empty. And I moved some of our chests in here. Stuff. These are pretty empty. Of course, the, uh, now there are more things down there, but it's mostly like common use late. Uh, so I figure uh, once I get everything established over here, that it will it'll work itself out. So what I want to do is I want to finish our basement. I went and. I had to go share some cheap because I only had six wool left and I needed another elevator to make the basement. Uh, so I took my man of steel shears over there and I sheared up all my sheep and got the got the wool and, that I needed and made another uh, room down here. And I already lined all the walls with deep slate. But what I was wanting to do was the floor, but I'm lazy and I didn't want to have to dig it all up. So I thought I would make a cool gadget to help with that. And I didn't put it uh, on the thing. So they have a new, it's not new, <laughs> they have a, an exchanging gadget as well as a building gadget. Part, as part of building gadgets. So this is pretty cheap too, so we might as well go ahead and get that as well. Um, I do need to get the... I don't know if this... Oh, it, it does look like it retained its um, charge. It has energy in it still. So what do we need? We need it couple of diamonds instead of two redstone is two lapis and a redstone. Okay. Mm -hmm. cool. Um I don't have crafting table so we'll just do it in my spell book. So and then uh, just throw this down over here temporarily and charge that up. Oh yeah. I don't know if this is gonna be enough. Okay. Now how do we do this? Options, controls, key binds. I guess that would still be under building gadgets. I wonder if it's G or any of the gadgets. Let's check that out. It is. So I want a surface. Surface, a range of light. No. Or no, maybe do like a five. I think that's what we want. And so if I shift, right click. Yeah. I don't think it will change out the elevator. Oh look, it won't do the ore either. So uh, That's how we did that. And the 
doesn't like the different materials. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. Stayed. Oh, no. Oh, no. Sleepy time. Wait a minute. It should be. Put a little pressure plate in front of the door. So that's cool. Now we got this whole room taken care of. Nice. I just wanted to make sure I recorded that on the camera. We don't need that. We don't really need chest. Awesome. So we got our exchanging gadget and we got the basement cleared. Now we need to set processing things up because we have no way to process our ores now if we go mining again. Which right now I don't have anything to process because we've already been processed. But I would like to establish a small sorting system so uh dire wolf has a new mod called laser eye oh it's still in progress of being made uh so it's only doing items right now which is all we need so it looks pretty cool um and this is my logic on combining magic uh magic mods and tech mods in a mod pack because uh, I want to do all magic. <laughs> I want to do all the things with magic but sometimes tech is just better. Uh, and this is my thoughts on it. Let me know what you think. Uh, that magic is awesome and cool tech is just magic that we understand and magic is just magic that we don't understand uh, so it's all magic to me <laughs> so yeah also i put the glass in here did not know this i was like oh this looks great but it's not connected textures uh, but over here, I have connected textures because it's connected glass. All you have to do to make the connected glass is take four glass and put it in your crafting grid, and you get four connected glass. So it's you might as well do it. Just, just do it. I didn't know when I put these in that you could get this for like absolutely no cost. Uh, so I would have done that, but I don't have a silk touch thing yet. Oh, we could make one from Britannia. They have that, that, uh, this, uh, it's like vitreous glass, I think. Vitreous glass. Yes. Yeah, so if I make this, we could get that. So it just takes two glass, which I don't have any of right now. A man of steel, which would be no problem, and two living wood twigs. Oh, look, I do have a little bit of glass. This is great. So, I have to go to the house to uh, see if I, how much living wood I have. I should have four. I think it's what I'll need to make two twigs. Hopefully I have that. I have exactly four. <laughs> That's perfect. Uh, oh, boom. Oh, this is just what I needed. I was really, it was really bugging me that I couldn't get that glass back to fix it. But now we should be able to fix it. 
no problem. And I'd like to get uh, more glass making so that I can uh, fill up all my windows. Yes. Oh, yeah. I was worried about having to make um, the beta glass to put in here. Because beta glass looks cool, but it's a very magical thing. It's not, it's not, a, it's not techish at all. I don't really want to do that. Oh, yeah, I got these up here I need to take care of, too. And I'm trying to spruce things up on the outside a little. So that it doesn't look just like a square building. I mean, it does look like a square building because it is a square building. Uh, but just to make it look less blockish. And they have a little more detail. Yes, that looks great. Uh, and I need lots of glass. I put in these windows just because. I didn't, I didn't like the whole, I don't know, what just felt really claustrophobic. These uh, square rooms and, <laughs> you know, no windows. I don't really like that. So I'm going to put glass in there. We got uh, most of these done. But I need a lot more glass. So I was going to, I was putting some cobble through the pulver or the, the macerator, <laughs> macerator, uh, to turn it into gravel. And then if I macerate it again, I could get sand. So we could have unlimited sand for all my glass beads. And that's what I was doing when I decided to move everything. But these were just going really super duper slow. So, but all I have right now to run off everything is one tiny basic generator and nothing else, and just some charcoal. So what we might need to do before I start trying to set up a new system, because I would like to just do thermal expansion because I think I've talked myself out of doing the industrial contraptions um, quarry. And I think I've decided to go builder with RF tools builder instead. Uh, because it's just, uh, it's not that it's necessarily cheaper. It's just that it's more basic materials. So I don't have to do a lot of processing for this. Uh, this is a really cheap, but the builder is a versatile block. You could use it for building. You can use it for pouring. Um, you can do lots of things with it. So, uh, also, you could do like a digital miner mechanism. I'm not sure how that works, but and also there's a mine colonist thing. So I thought maybe. Uh, we might be able to do either one of those, but I think I've talked myself out of the quarry. Uh, so I don't really need to go into industrial contractions that much because the quarry, yeah, you got to have an advanced machine block, advanced circuits, advanced alloys, diamond pick. Look at all this stuff, copper coils, advanced alloys, machine block, carbon plates. You just got to have a lot of... Uh, infrastructure I guess to do that but the builder you still need like the shape card for this so it is pretty uh, you know, still costly you still got to put a diamond and emerald redstone and gas tier which I think I actually I think I the gas tier somewhere I think, yeah I got two so I can gas that's you know almost <laughs> anyway um, what was that thing? Oh yes, we got we got our victory pickaxe. Um, this is the way I would go, but 
we need better power for this stuff. So what I was thinking is I could get, oh, it's a pump. You could use it for a pump too. But this pump looks, this pump again, you got to have advanced stuff to make it. Uh, so I don't think I want to do that. So I think I would either go with this pump, which is pretty basic. It is nine diamonds. Uh, but to do this, I think there's a pump card. Yeah, so you could pump with a pump card. So you just need like some buckets and some redstone and a shape card. Uh, so that's pretty expensive too. Uh, but, and I think honestly that this is probably based off of this block. <laughs> uh, I don't know. So, I mean, yeah, I'll probably just go ahead and make this pump. Um, and then we'd need like a, a magma, a magmatic dynamo to produce power. Uh, I don't think there are any other like lava generators, machines, I think. I think industrial contraptions thermal thermal generator, but I don't know if that is, I don't know exactly, I don't remember exactly how this works or how it got changed. Uh, because there used to be more advanced machines in industrial craft itself. Like it had an upgraded uh, smelter that would give you multiple input and output slots so you could process more <laughs> uh, in less time. Or, you know, that's the basic gist of it. So what I want to do is maybe prepare for this a little bit by getting our pump and where did it go? Did, oh, did I already have a magmatic dynamo? I think I'm just going to go with the magmatic dynamo. It must have already been up there. And, but the thing is we need an this. Yikes. So I might need to go ahead and set up the industrial craft stuff just to be able to make the end bar because uh, I think if I make dust I should be able to make it. <clears throat> so Let's get our stuff out. Mass Raider. Um, get some coal. Uh, yeah, we want our overclocker and vector upgrades. I think that's all we need. Oh, that's <laughs> what the chest is. These were like my input and output chest stuff. So let's just come over here and get our basic generator, powered furnace. You know, so I want that the other way around. I must be out of the way. Did not repair. And um, yeah, get our big bad macerator and power furnace. And then we can put our, oh, sad. okay, so we can put our chest up here, input chest, so now I need two more chests though. So let's do
And other things. I'm assuming it's been print something else. Okay, so now I should be able to get some of my nickel that I have over here. And take some iron and put it through the macerator. Macerator, which is over on this side. Hopefully that will give us our dust, uh, but we might need some power. <laughs> um, where did I put my charging? Oh, my charging station over here. So since we had to have this set up back, let's just go ahead and get it ready because we might need a little bit more power and whatnot on our adventures. All right, there's the dust coming in. Did we have any sand? Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put the sand through the furnace. Make some more because I know I'm going to need it. Okay, it's still working. Oh, what we could do while we're waiting on that to process up, I think it'll be at least uh, we'll be able to get that done. Um, let me go ahead and I might want to make some more of these. I want to put one at my house uh, and then I don't have to worry about getting around it or anything. Um, so let's get a pocket storage and see how that goes. Well, we need two pistons and a chest and some iron. So let's just get uh, some iron. Redstone. I didn't really see a lot of anything else. Um, oh, I need some wood to make planks for the pistons. There we go. Uh, redstone. So we need two pistons. Right. A chest. Oh, we can make a chest too. There we go. Now, and the boot. Yeah. So, um, let's make another one of those. Can make two more pistons. Chest. And because I, I want a good amount of storage to be able to in for a while, you know, when I get the, in the mood. Get in the mood. Awesome. Uh, but I want to upgrade them. This is only tier one. So we can get it upgraded to tier two with two more pistons, two more chests, and some gold. <laughs> but we should be able to get both of them upgraded. Uh, so we need four pistons. Yikes, I don't think I have enough wood out. See if that's enough. Oh, wrong one. So we need four chests as well. So, so, um, you know, I want you, Boink, and, uh, Oh, yeah. So how much does this hold? Pocket storage unit tier 2. Um, 64. Um, it holds 15 different items. 
but how much does it store? Does it say? Our ship holds 16 different items up to 4,000. Automatically absorbs lights, items, light items on pickup voids access. Sneak right click a chest to deposit items and sneak left click a chest to withdraw magic contents. That is pretty darn cool. So, yeah. Um, there is another upgrade, it's two, which takes four diamonds. Oh, I think I think I want to do that. Sure. So <laughs> I think that would be a good investment uh, to make get all the stuff in the games. <laughs> um, so we need four more chests. I think I'm going to need some more wood. So we need four more chests. And Four more pistons. We should be able to get that guy in there. Now how much? Thirty-two different items and sixty-five thousand of each. Yes, that is definitely what I need. Um I think you can rename this uh with an anvil maybe can you use like a tinker's anvil i don't know uh so we can um we can make an anvil real quick this, this thing. Yeah, that's what we're at Oh, I need one, two, three, and it's an anvil considered stone, it's cobblestone extra. So, there's our anvil. Um, let us put our anvil right here. And will, is this the one that I put Okay, we'll say I put it in there. Uh, blocks. Oh, I don't have any experience. <laughs> I put it all in the jar down here. Just need a little bit. Yeah, that should work. I gotta get in there and get to sleep. All right, and um, man, I didn't get enough stuff done. It's almost time, uh, but we did make progress. We did make progress. Let's get. Is this the one? Yes. Go ahead and put it in there. Call it blocks. Sleep, and then we'll name the other one like uh, uh, my precious, <laughs> something like that. Um, precious, my precious, precious. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> All right. We did it. We did some stuff and things. It's time to call the episode now. Uh, I'm so glad I got some of the stuff done. Let's get that. We put that. Get that in there. Man. We can put these uh, locks in there. Yeah. 
goes away in there. Oh, this is cool. I like it. And then I could do some celebratory mining. Because <laughs> we now have a lot more ability to store all of our stuff and things. And I turned off the void jump. So we get lots of stuff. All right, we're going to go ahead and call the episode here. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.